We've made a lot of different varieties of mashed potatoes, and they seem to be endless, but what we're going to do today is make the classic French mashed potatoes, the type that you get a lot of fine dining restaurants. Let's go ahead and get this started. The thing with this recipe, it does take just a little bit longer than your normal recipes. What we've done here is we've taken one pound of Yukon Gold potatoes, we peeled them, cut them into one inch squares, and then we've rinsed them off. We want to rinse them off just to make sure we get rid of the excess starch. In a saucepan here, we're going to add two-thirds cup of milk, three-fourths cup of, uh, I'm sorry, three-fourths <laughs> teaspoon of salt, and we're going to add one-fourth a teaspoon of white pepper, We're going to stick this into our, we're going to put our potatoes in our pan. And then we're going to put this on medium heat. Once this begins to simmer, we're then going to put a lid on it and then put it down to low. And we're then we're going to cook this for up to 45 minutes. We're going to check it after 25 minutes because we want to make sure that our potatoes aren't getting too soft. The age of your potato depends a lot on how long it's going to take for your potato I mean, for for them to cook in our milk mixture. All right, if you notice around the edges here, it's beginning to boil a little bit. We're going to um, turn that down to low, put a lid on this, and we're going to let this simmer. We're going to check it in approximately 25 minutes. Okay, our potatoes are almost done. It's only taking us about 25 minutes or so to cook ours. I've got here one stick. Our butter, it is salted and it's chilled. We want to make sure our butter is cold. I tend to little cubes. It's kind of a messy process, but if you watch our uh, video on the, uh, oh, which one are we making? The meat. The meat. Oh, yeah. We made, yeah. We're making a Salisbury steak video, and you'll see what kind of mess that I made. Something I'm extremely good at. All right, we got these almost all chopped. Set this off to the side. Got a little strainer here, and we're going to strain off our potatoes. All right, and then them back in our pan, and look, that's the first time I haven't made a mess today. We're then going to take our potato masher here. We're going to go ahead and mash our potatoes. Now, you, if you have a, a, a potato press, you can use the potato press. Because what you're really looking for is that nice fluffiness and creaminess. We're now going to add to that our butter. You make sure you get all that butter melted. It's going to be heavy and butter flavored. It's more like a nice whipped potato. We're then going to take, if your potatoes are just a little bit dry, that milk that you strained off, make sure you save it. You can add one quarter of a cup that milk back into our mashed potatoes, or I should say whipped potatoes. And there we have it, a very light, buttery French mashed potato recipe.